And greetings y'all. Hey, this is Old Man Gib, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to find the abandoned courier in Napoleos' Fortune 2. Now I'm gonna zoom out here. <clears throat> I have now I've used some console stuff to reveal everything, so it'll make it easier to do these videos for y'all. But once you get to Napoleos' Fortune 2. Come in the jump gate here from Treasure Chest, or even if you're coming in from Napoleos' Fortune 6, you're going to look for the, the trade lane, okay? It runs all the way down. Almost directly in line with that at the very end is this courier. Now we're going to fly out there. Autopilot engaged. We're going to cat. We're going to get this. Now, in <clears throat> I've seen reports that in um, some people will go to these sectors and they can't find the ships. Now, I don't know why, because in absolutely every playthrough I have done, this ship is in the exact same sector in the exact same spot. So, um, if you're running mods, or maybe it's if you start a different start. Now, I started with the... Uh, yeah, the young guns start, so maybe that has something to do with it. If you choose a different start, I'm not sure, but this is, um, the start that I always, the, you know, I, I either use this or the, um, the scientist start now to do the the scientist start you have got to have progressed in the game a certain amount and then it will um, unlock that start but um, yeah this is a great way to get um, early in the game to get free ships but also to get some um, starting credits because you can sell these now this courier is real handy because one you can use it to uh, do sector trade, local trade with. But also, if you come out and get it, I think it'll hold six uh, crew. You can actually use it to go around and get the other um, abandoned ships. Just go get you, throw you some Marines on there and use it to go get them. Now, only one of the abandoned ships is in what we call hostile space xenon space and that is the odysseus but all the others are in you know relatively friendly space now going out to them you may run into some xenons or some car or some pirates or something like that but you know yeah this is you know a really easy early way to make bank on some free stuff so we're gonna cruise on out here now you got some uh, hat you've got SCA out here neither one of these guys are gonna bother you early game I have just thought of a fencing endeavor if you are interested do come and talk to me and I will explain autopilot autopilot engaged all right now see we came out of that and like coasted a long ways so we've got Career, Vanguard. 270 to go. Auto I'm going to kill Disengage. the autopilot because I don't want it to stop me around all these rocks and we'll just fly out there. Now we're going to capture this Joker. All right, looks like we've got a couple. We got a Xenon out there fighting with some SCA and a Talati dude. It's okay. We'll let them keep fighting. Now this ship, the Elite that I'm in, is this uh, 
starting ship for this this character and it's not a real fast ship it's not a real strong ship it's a little tiny uh glass bubble floating around in space but it'll work for what we needed to do autopilot engaged Autopilot disengaged. Now, because I didn't purchase a captain, I can come out here. We're going to capture this Joker, and I don't have to worry about my ship. Elite Vanguard. Flying anywhere. Alright, so now we have this a courier. Now what I'm going to do is take this Joker, information crew. Well, actually what I can do is this. Pick you. I want to... There we go. All right, you work somewhere else. Captain. All right, so now we can have our elite go somewhere safe. Let's say, where's a close safe haven? Uh, we're going to say... Go there and dock and wait. Alright. Now I'm going to take this courier. Now I am going to use a cheat here. Turn that on. Alright, so now let's look at this courier. There's our courier. It's free. Its stats are... Can hold up to 150 metric tons uh, of cargo. Courier, stupid. There we go. Six crew capacity. 1960 in cargo. Let's see, it's got 2200 in hull, 703 in shields, cruising speeds 290. So, um, this is a pretty decent little ship for cruising around the galaxy. It's got some basic stuff on it, no big deal. It's got one pulse laser Mark II. All right, and its location. Let me zoom in right here. Right there. And that is where you find the courier in the Pelos's Fortune 2. Now we will come back in the next video and I will be showing you where to find the Osprey Vanguard, and we'll, I'll see you in that one. So this is Old Man Gib. May y'all have an absolutely outstanding and wonderful day, and I will talk with you in the next one.